And let me just tell y'all a little bit, just quickly, and I'm going to go past this. This Republican and Democrat thing. But I'm a Democrat, and I'm a Republican. There's some people that look at me because I'm a black man, say I'm a Democrat from Mississippi. Obviously, just assume that I'm a Democrat from Mississippi. All right, I'm Mississippi. I'm in the Mississippi Delta. He's a Democrat. Well, he's a white man, and he's from Mississippi. He's a Republican. Why are you assuming that? You don't know what God told me. If I have to be anything, it's because God sent me there. Y'all mm -hmm. better hear what I'm saying. And that does not deter. I don't care how much the Republican did. I don't care how much the Democrat did. I don't care who owns it is and who got that and who did this and who did that. What did God say to you? Mm -hmm. Amen. Mm -hmm. Amen. You far above yeah. powers and dominions. You far above all authority. Yeah. What is the word of God to you? Do you need to be in there? Well, well, Pastor Johnson, God called me to the Democrat Party. Well, God called me to the Libertarian Party. Well, then, Pastor Johnson, God called me to the Republican Party. I don't judge myself by what God said to you, because between you and God, God said you high and above it was against all authority and all principles. You don't all have to be Republicans. You don't all have to be Democrats. What you all be what God tell you to be. And if you don't be anything, you be don't be anything. Amen. Who set this up? Mm -hmm. That's it. That's right. Mm -hmm. Are, are y'all understanding what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. We got to separate ourselves. That's right. From authority, taking authority over us. Yeah. When God, those words, those words of those authorities can take authority over us. And we can miss out on the authority that God has given us over these situations. Mm -hmm. Now, I know some Christians can't pray for Democrats because they're Republicans. There's some Republicans can't pray for Democrats, and there's some Democrats can't pray for Republicans. Like some Baptists can't pray for Methodists. Do you understand what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. And it's the same old religious spirit that the devil thinks that he can hold back. But when the church stands up yes, Lord. Amen. Amen. and realize who they are in the authority. <coughs> Y'all hear what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. This is important for us to understand. Mm -hmm. Because if we don't understand this, we're going to miss out on the authority that God has given us as the church. There's nobody else. There's nobody else. God, God ain't got nobody else but the church. He has nobody else but the blood-washed Christian. That's why he said, if my people, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. which are called by my name. He said, I'm not talking about the rest of the people. I'm talking about mine. Yeah. Yeah. The ones that's called by my name would humble yeah. themselves. If, if, if my people would humble themselves. When you, listen, 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 listen. Don't bring on judgment. All you got to do is hang out with the word. Amen. He set you high. Listen to this. Whether angelic or human, far above every name that is named, above every title that can be conferred. We, we need to hear that. Every title that can be conferred. You know what they confer these things on people now? Doctor, researcher, apostle, his apostle, and the apostle, the prophet, and people confer. We just confer you. There's some people that can be conferred that ain't been confirmed. <laughs> you understand what I'm saying? But when you get into the will and the word of God, 